Hello, this is the Wall 200 with another video. Today's video is going to be about Super Saiyan 4 and the possibilities of it coming to Dragon Ball Super. Now, they left this open with the, you know, the Broly movie because he was able to use his Ozaro powers even though he didn't transformation, do the transformation. So, they did have, you know, this little thing where they, they could bring in Super Saiyan 4 into Super and it could work and they don't need their tails anymore so the idea of this surprisingly so i think is a good idea i know that may <laughs> surprise a lot of people but it wouldn't be that bad of an idea really i think they could really do a lot with the transformation into super if they decide to bring it in now it's not official or anything like that but there has been a lot of talks that they might bring it in because um moro I guess took away the Super Saiyan curse, whatever that fucking means. Uh, so, the idea of it, I kind of, I really like it, to be honest. It's like, they could do a lot with the story and maybe do redo GT all over again and retell it where it could be canon. Because they can only go so far with the certain villains and Morrow and... The storyline can only go so far before they have to amp up the, you know, the power of villains by quite a bit. Because they're kind of a... I want to say they completely wrote themselves into a corner, but it's getting to that point where they're, Vegeta and Goku are so damn powerful that figuring out villains that, they, that even somewhat compete with them is going to be extremely hard to do, so... Super Saiyan 4 might actually, you know, alleviate that kind of a, uh, I guess, problem with the because they could bring in villains from, like, GT and have it, you know, hopefully seamless or as seamless as possible to bring into it and go from there. So it wouldn't be all that bad. Now, they could really fuck it up. Don't get me wrong, they have fucked up things in Super, so it's not 100% guaranteed that they could make something and make it where it makes sense and all the, all that stuff. So, there's always that possibility they could totally fuck that up and ruin Super Saiyan 4. So, it might not be a good idea to bring it in and introduce it and uh, make stories with it. So, I think it's a good idea. But it could uh, turn into something that really just really disappoint. But that's pretty much all I have to say about it. Thank you for listening. Right, comment, and subscribe.